Hi everybody and welcome to part 7 of this Rome Total War Britain campaign and we are currently besieging Mabu Marti Nabu Martius sorry. Um, he has quite a large garrison so i am got to take this battle seriously but at the moment we can't recruit anything in terms of mercenaries because we only have 12 denarii so I'm going to end the turn and see what happens. Okay, small Gallic force just come onto the scene but I don't consider them a problem really. Okay, I think what I might do actually is not attack the city straight away. I might hold out from attacking. So instead we're going to concentrate on other matters. Okay, ooh, Dacia has become a protectorate of Scythia. I think that's what that means. And we have a spy now, although I do want to recruit a second one. So we can have one spying on the Germans in case they send an army through the woods. And one to spy on the Gauls in the south. And I don't think any place can build at the moment that isn't building. Except for this place which can... I can lower the tax rate because I need to help their public growth. Um, so they can get to the next level. And... Oh yes, we have our diplomats who I was sending to talk to the Greeks and the Macedonians so we'll send him further down and we're currently in the land of the Brutii okay so we could attack but I'm not going to because I'm worried let's just end the turn again okay ghoul spy And he got in the city. Okay, maybe I should have attacked because now I've got this on my hands. Although it will be a battle in the open field, so hopefully a bit better. Two to one, so they have the advantage, although I'm sure we'll win. They have no missile units. Although they do in this army, but none in the other army. So, obviously, save the backup. And fight the battle. The reason I'm doing it this way is I have much more confidence in our army on the field of battle rather than when it comes to sieging, city, besieging cities because that's in tight streets and they can be bottlenecked. On the open field it's sort of just our units are pretty good so hopefully that will come through. No speeches today thank you. And what a weird map we're on. Giant hills either side but mostly flat where we are. Right. We're on the defensive today, so I'm going to probably go up into this corner here. Okay, let's make some sort of shield wall. He thinks. Okay, right. Backed up by some, oh god no, backed up by some swordsmen, and then make it a little bit longer, put them in the background, no, right way, should be an idiot. Okay, right, I'll move out of the way, and that's group one. And that's not all our miss our units, so I'm gonna just put him in there. Right, that's all our infantry. Wait a minute. No, it's not, sorry. There's this guy who will be right at the back. Right. That is all our infantry. Done. Okay, our general is gonna back up the infantry. Got us big triangles. Along with a unit of chariots. But our other two cavalry are gonna try and go round and kill some guys and then we've got our missile units which I plan to utilize quite well in this battle okay and I think that's everyone so there's two armies one is coming from all the way up on that hill which we can't see well we can a little bit and the other units here right <coughs> time to use our um, missile units although 
these shield walls are going to be pretty good I expect okay time to use these guys I'm going to actually run over here so I'm a bit higher higher, higher than them so I have an advantage there come on run guys weird looking ground there could be scorched or something right I should be alright because none of these none of this army has any missile units although they do have cavalry so oh, come over here guys now fight on okay let's see if we can cause some damage a little bit yeah we're doing they've gone from uh, 121 to 95 hopefully when they're we're facing their back oh god no run away <laughs> Yeah, if we're facing their behind, their back, they should be even weaker. Okay, run away, run away, run away. Come on, guys. You've got skirmish mode on. You should be running away. And stop now. You can stop. I'll go the routing. Excellent. Right, now, now you can just hit these guys. these guys thank you where's the other army still coming down yeah that might be a while away I might get my cavalry and get them round to oh no these guys are back okay right I think it's time to kill this captain going after our missile units. Run away, run away, run away. Come on, I can't see. Stupid hill. No, you're going to go after these guys, you idiot. Come on. Okay, our shield wall should be able to repel that. I, get over here. Okay, I was worried about that. But, we've got cavalry support coming along. They should do an alright job. Oh, come on, guys. Please hurry up. You're so slow. Go around here, go around this side, go around this side. And smack them in the back. Now charge. The enemy warlord flees from our work. There we go, there's the their captain dead. Is dead. Slain by your brave warriors. Let's try and kill these 30 spearmen, although it's probably not. I hate it when they don't do what you say. Okay, shield walls fighting at the moment. over there. Okay, let's help them a little bit. Oh good, they're routing. Time to kill a few of them before the main army comes along. Both of you please. Okay, let's go over it. Where there's swordsmen here, but they don't seem to be doing much, just waving their swords about. Okay, right, what about these cavalry? Still mopping up. Oh, that's a long line they have, the other army. They're going to 
be a problem. Okay, right, they've almost won now. You get back into line. Okay, that's our barbarian mercenaries running away. Okay, you can let them go now. Let's try and go after these guys. What? They're not routing. They're trying to attack us. Run away. Missile units attack. No, 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 no. Go this way. Don't you get hit? Why did you go veer to the left at the time? Don't. I should fire on them now. But no damage at all. Great. Ah, oh, great. Okay, some cavalry coming along now. Time to get into gear. And get our general into action. Right, group one, make your shield wall. So make shield. Why can't I make your shield wall? For sake. I know there's buttons you can use to make them turn and that, but I. Why is it come back? Come back! For God's sake, don't be annoying. Okay, we're just gonna make a blob again as we usually do, I think, because this is not working. I can't make him do any line or anything. It's really annoying me. So we're just gonna charge and then. What's that? 24. Right, okay. Chariots get away from there. We're going after the Deer General. God, chariots are very difficult to manoeuvre. Okay, this might be a bad idea because they've got spearmen, but. If it's a chance to kill their general, I am willing to take it. Okay, mass route it seems for the enemy. Yes, and their general's dead. Excellent, this is a good battle. <laughs> okay, what's happening up here? Right, we have a unit of swordsmen chasing some skirmishers being chased by warbands, so bit of a pickle. Okay, General, you're in a bit of danger. Get out of the danger. Thank you very much. Okay. Warhounds and swordsmen. No, I don't think I want to get involved in that. Okay, these guys are routing for some reason or another. I don't know. Time to run them over. Okay, our units have seemed to split up into two groups. I have no idea why. I said to attack these guys, I'm sure. Okay, attack the skirmishers. Come on, guys, attack the skirmishers. Swordsmen against light infantry, I think so. Where's my two cavalry? God, they're in the thick of it. I right, get out of that. We need to be getting all these. Oh, yeah. You need to attack all these routing units, that's what I'm trying to say. Okay, right. Oh, it's the end of the battle. Right, just time for a mass route now and killing everything we can see. 
Excellent. That's how I like it. So to begin with, to begin with, we were losing men, and the battle was in the balance really. But then they attacked our line, which um, and our line holded held intact. So and their morale began to waver, and we eventually pulled through to have ultimate victory. And we've killed 91% at the loss of 22%. So yeah, good ratio. Well, that's obviously always you can always improve on that because I did lose quite a lot of my missile units. Actually, I've lost one entire unit. I've only got one unit left. So yeah, you can always improve on that because of the cavalry. Didn't chase them down quick enough. I think we'll end here. Oh, heroic victory. Great. I'm really happy about that. Well, I've still got over a thousand troops left and they've only got about 90. <laughs> so that was a good battle. And now we should be able to take the city of Naboo Martius with great ease. Actually we'll be able to take it straight away. <laughs> Okay, a green face, that means we can occupy. And another city falls under our control. And we can plan our next move, which I think we're going to go for this city of Messia. can't say it properly. Oh, it's a rebel city, although it's a really small garrison. Well, this could be an easy take, this could. Okay, our general got some more traits, I think. Oh, and a famous battle. Yeah, I don't know if I told you this before, but if you have a really good battle, it becomes a famous battle. And a little symbol of two swords clashing appear on the map, and it tells the date, and obviously who won and who lost. And as you can see, we won. So that was a famous battle. It was good. Okay, lots of diplomatic information. Uh, more people becoming protectorates. God, this thing doesn't work. Germany is now at war with Scythia, so maybe they won't be attacking us for a while because they'll be concentrating on just defeating them. Okay. We can. No, we can't really increase the tax rate at the moment. What we can do is retrain. Retrain our troops. In fact, we can't retrain barbarian mercenaries, so we might as well group them. Although I can't seem to. Okay, right. There we go. Building, building, building. Alicia, I think, can build something. Oh, yes, it can. Firstly, it, it can retrain these troops. Okay, it's losing a hell of a lot of money. So maybe a great market will stem that. Yeah, it increases it by a little bit. Okay, spy. Head off into. Germany territory. Well, they have small armies dotted about, so they could be a threat. I'm going to see if I can change to a financial bill policy, although it's 90%, and then I'm not losing so much money then. Right, Londinium. We can expand our port to the next level. And we've run out of money again. We only have 200. We'll have to wait till next turn, it seems. Financially, we're sound, we're going to have 5,000 almost by next turn. So I think I will go after this city, capture it, and then that's a good border. So, and then I can concentrate on Iberia and Spain and all that by taking this city here. So, obviously our diplomat, we can't forget him. Continue our journey southward. We're not in Greece, Greek territory yet, but we will be soon. And we now control 10 provinces, so about one fifth of the way there, already by part 7. And we've won 23 battles and lost none. Good. And we have 19 family members. Right. Time to end the turn again. Okay, another spy. They seem to have a lot of them, but no matter really. 
Okay, we're almost fully trained. I'm actually going to head out because I won't need such a large force. Okay, that place has finished its farming. Um, marketplace. I know it doesn't increase it by much, but yeah, here's something. Okay, I think we're going to, with our spy, going to the interior of Germany. So we're going to continue to march forward all the way to their capital, which is here. And see what sort of army they have, or armies, I should say. Okay, we can now build here, in these northern cities. Marketplace, and a meeting hall. And that's about all that money gone. Okay, are we ready yet? Okay, Athens. Controlled by the Greeks. Quite rightly so as well. Trade rights, map information, for map information. You accept. And you seem to have a small foothold in Greece and then some islands as well. Okay, up to Macedon we go. And let's send our general out. And excellent, he can recruit some mercenaries. Okay. Growth your policy please. Right, what am I going to take with me? I won't need a huge army. Although I will take most of my mercs with me. Can the Boom Artists make swordsmen? Oh they can. Yeah, we're going to build our big army here. We're going to have this going to be a main military base. Okay, I'll take some more. Okay, one more. I'll take my missile unit. That should be more than enough. Oh, let's recruit another missile unit, I think. Let's get our spy in there, 93%. Oh, they only have two units. This can be probably an auto-resolve, to be honest with you. Okay, threat increased. My spy gets sneaky, whatever. It's not spying, it's a quest for knowledge. And it gives him a plus one to agent skill, plus one to line of sight. Great. I think it's time to end the turn again. Okay, the ghouls are besieging our ports. But not a major problem, to be honest compared to some others. And the gate is not open. I was hoping that would be open so it would be a quick battle. But no, you can't always get your own way. Right. Time for some more recruitment. I think we'll build some war bands because they're cheap and easy to maintain to begin with. Oh, we have to sort out this rebel army at some point. I will do it eventually. Okay, there's no building, I don't think, to be doing. Although our spy can continue his journey. Okay, these German cities don't really seem to be very heavily defended, although they do have lots of armies dotted around, like here and so forth. Okay, he's blocking the bridge, so we'll probably have to go around this way. Uh, our diplomat. Okay, that's owned by the Brutii now. I thought it was owned by Mastodon. They seem to be advancing at quite a rate. Okay. And they own this city as well, here. <laughs> and they own Byzant Byzantium. Okay. They are growing. They're probably much further ahead. They're probably in terms of the Roman factions, they're probably the one that's most ahead. Okay, so let's end the turn. Right. End turn reports, construction, recruitment, and diplomatic information. Right. We will be proceeding that city this turn. First things first, just want to build. 
a sacred circle, I think. It's like Stonehenge. Although I've never been to Stonehenge. Stonehenge, I don't know what it looks like. Okay, we're just going to have to wait until that gets to the next level of development before we can build stuff. Okay. Actually, firstly, let's move all our agents. Okay, this bridge is now free, so we can go across. Oh, and that, the capital does have a medium-sized garrison, but yet again, not huge, and they have a rebel army outside. Um, our diplomat, again, on his journeys. Hopefully they won't control this city. At last, we've found the Macedonian city. Trade rights, map information, for map information, please. They accept. They have two settlements, one there and one down in Africa. But they seem to be much weaker than they were. I think we'll talk to Thrace next. Another Greek-style faction. That's actually quite fun to play as, to be honest. You can't normally play as them, but you can unlock them. Okay, now to the proper business of the day. Let's save and let's attack. <laughs> oh, I've never seen that ratio before, 100 to 3, I've never seen it that big. I think this will be an auto resolve, mind you. <laughs> 100 to 3 and they still killed 68, yeah. That auto resolve is very accurate, not. Well, that was pointless really. Okay, red face, so we're going to be taking the decision to exterminate the populace. And it's still a blue face, god, they really are unhappy. Although I will destroy their <laughs> shrine and build our own one. We need health, I mean happiness, so we're going to build that. Okay, right. Low tax rates, alright. And our agent, I'm going to send him forward here to see what's happened to these lands. And I think that's going to be the end of this turn as we can't do anything with this town really in terms of recruitment. So, quite successful this episode. Thank you very much for watching and I shall see you next time.